we're gonna weigh one gram of sodium bicarbonate in order to prepare 10% of sodium bicarbonate solution the solution is used to power the sodium uh, hypochlorite So it is one gram yep. of uh, sodium bicarbonate, sodium bicarbonate yep. four nine millimeters. Yeah, this is millimeters of uh, water. Yeah, uh, the solution is considered weight to volume ratio. Just consider one gram of sodium bicarbonate in ten mL of water. And that's what weight to volume ratio is. And for sodium bicarbonate, it takes a little bit of time and shaking in order to get completely dissolved. So you have to make sure um, to invert it for like three to five minutes to get completely dissolved. Solution to adjust the pH of sodium bicarbonate. This solution can serve as a power solution to reduce the pH. The regular pH of sodium hypochlorite is around 11, and we need to bring it down to nine pH. Mm -hmm. and we're going to use the solutions to adjust that pH. The reason of use this, this solution is because uh, it has uh, no side effect pretty much and uh, no damage for the living tissue. Instead of using uh, hypochlorite which is have some effect on the living tissue, so we're going to use sodium bicarbonate to adjust the pH. Okay, and in this step now we're preparing 0.5% concentrations of sodium hypochlorite. The stock solutions of sodium hypochlorite uh, called bleach it's come with 8.25% concentrations. In order to make the final concentrations of 8.5% uh, uh, of sodium hypochlorite, we need to uh, use this formula. This formula considers concentrations 1, which is 8.25%, uh, that's the stock solutions. The volume 1, which is we, that's what we try to figure out. The concentration 2 here. It's the final, all final concentration, which is 0.5% uh, of sodium hypochlorite and the volume 2, the desired concentration that we want to prepare. In our situations, we want to prepare 10 ml of 0.5% of sodium hypochlorite. We have the stock uh, concentrations 8.25, uh, the, con the final concentration. 0.5% of sodium hypochlorite, the final volume of sodium hypochlorite, 0.5% concentrations, and the volume one, which is we tried to figure out. We like all these numbers in this formula, and we get to this uh, number 0.61 ml of sodium hypochlorite plus 9.38 ml of water. We're gonna have a final concentrations of 0.8. Uh, of 0.5 percent of sodium hypochlorite. Okay. I'm adding uh, 9.39 ml of sterile water under the hood to my test tube. It's proper to use the 50 ml test tube in order to have it fit properly with the pH meter prop because the diameter is wider than the 15 ml test tube. Then we're gonna add 60.61 uh, ml of uh, sodium, sodium hypochlorite, the stock solution, which is 8.25 ml. Now we have 0.8, only 5%. 0.5% uh, of uh, sodium hypochlorite, 10 ml of volumes, but with four, but has unknown pH. So we're gonna.
so here we right now we're getting the, the pH the pH of the 0.5 sodium hypochlorite the solution that you prep let's say okay and we want to adjust it down to nine nine pH pH okay and we are going to adjust the pH with the sodium Biocarbonate. Now we try to adjust the pH of 0.5% of sodium hypochlorite. The final pH of the unpowered, uh, unpowered uh, sodium bicarbonate is almost 10.8. Uh, so we're going to use the sodium bicarbonate to adjust that pH and drop it down to uh, uh, 9 pH. So we're making sure that all sodium uh, bicarbonate is completely homogenized. And uh, before we add, we're gonna do read so we can watch our pH live. Lower than nine, we need to bring it up. We use a uh, basic solution. We normally use uh, sodium hydroxide. No more mm -hmm. pH of the one mole of sodium hydroxide is around 13 pH, and that's what we use to adjust the pH up. Okay. Drop by drop, right? Okay. You observe the monitor. So how many drops have you had so already so far? Uh, I had almost eight drops right now. Eight drops. Okay. But it depends on the final uh, or total volume of your uh, bubble that you want to prepare. So two more drops. Seems like we have finally reached the. Uh, 9 pH so now we have our Dunkin Dunkin solution ready it's a 0.5 sodium hypochlorite with a pH of 9 okay thank you Ali you're welcome doctor